Hi, good afternoon. Welcome to Business. My name is Daryl Kwao. The Ministry of Food and Agriculture is rolling out a technology to reduce rejection of Ghana's food export commodities on the EU market. Known as the e-traceability system, it will support product quality improvement for goods ready for export to enhance market entry. The mechanism feeds into Ghana's 10-year national export development strategy to increase our non-traditional export revenue to $25 billion by the year 2029. Prince Apia was at a sensitization workshop in Kumase and has more. After the European Union banned some fruits and vegetables from Ghana from entering its market, the Food and Agriculture Ministry started manual inspection of goods before exports. Though effective, it had some gaps that needed to be filled. The new electronic tracking system being introduced is expected to replace the manual system to ensure that flagged products are chased to the exact farm. Director Project at Ghana Export and Promotions, Alexander Dajawa, says this will be fully implemented by end of 2023. And concerns have been raised severally about um, uh, quality of products that are consumed. You know these days people are very careful about their health. Um, and so they are careful that everything that is imported into their country is able to meet their market requirements. Traceability simply means that when something is exported and it goes out to another country and there's a challenge to that particular product, it must be traced back to the origin or where it comes from. And that gives assurance and protection to the consumers in the markets to believe that when they consume products from anywhere in the world, they are safe. And even if something happens, they are able to trace it back and take corrective measures. And so this has become an imperative uh, in all markets. The e-traceability technology focuses its efforts on Ghanaian shea and coconut-based cosmetic products, cassava, mango and pineapples. Mr. Dajawa says the objective is for Ghana to achieve increased export revenue. The target is that we should reach all producers, processes, uh, countrywide in Ghana, so that it doesn't matter where the product is coming from, from the remotest area of Ghana. Once it is going to be part of the product that will be exported out of Ghana, it must come under the traceability system. Because it's all about market entry. If you are not able to send your products into the market, certainly you will not be able to get the revenue. And the assurance that the market gets from us showing that we are able to put the system in place will open more doors for us to uh, ensure that we export more. The Plant Protection and Regulatory Services has already conducted mapping exercise on the selected value chains in the various regions.